Okay, hello everyone. Thank you for joining me again and welcome to the armature tutorial today. Armatures are basically wire structures that will help you put any kind of modeling clay, uh, paper mache, or in our case, salt dough onto your basically a skeleton of a structure that you're making. This gives it support and um, strength so that you can make all sorts of different shapes and unique things. So things that you're going to need are wire. I like using the needle nose pliers but if you don't have them hopefully you might be able to find some wire that is easily pliable. I found some wire off of this notebook and this is kind of a thick notebook and the wire is a little bit thicker than what you might find on a 60 page notebook so hopefully you can find something and I'm going to start by just showing you how I manipulate the wire and using the example that I have all right so here's my workspace here hopefully all right so you can see I've got this little guy here and I just wrap the wire around any kind of limb I want to have uh, probably a double wire to give it enough strength here so I measured it out and then of course the torso here I just wrapped it around so for this I am just going to uh, just quickly, quickly make a little shape out of it. Um, I'm going to maybe bend the wire here for a foot. And I don't want to cut this wire because I want it all the same because attaching the wire is a little bit difficult process, for me at least, and I don't want you guys to struggle with it, but I'm going to go here, bend it back, see I'm bending it back, and then I'm going to bend it back up, and then wrap it around, and then I might have it come all the way back, and let's see, I'll just have a, a shape like this, and it'll be just maybe a creature. Okay, so once I have this, I can take my salt dough and just glop it on there. Now, salt dough is not the best, but it's what I have. So the whole thing about this process is using what I have and being creative and trying to figure out what works. So, got my little three-legged creature here. Now, once I've got as much clay on here that I want, I'm going to do a couple different layers uh, because of what I'm finding is the salt dough is a little bit tricky to work with. So, just kind of, I'm just kind of putting it on here now. Once I have it on here, I'm going to put it into the oven at 175 degrees. In the, um, in the lesson that I'm going to put on our Google Classroom, I'll put all of this information for you. But 175 degrees, you can, I've read some things where you can go up to 200 degrees. I didn't want it too hot, but basically put it in the oven and then it will come out looking something like this. And so now once I've got this, it's dry, it's a little bit stiff, and I can add things to it. So I'm going to take a little ball here, put a shoulder muscle on there, and of press it on, and then smooth it out. I don't know if you notice, but this is, I'm intending this to be a famous 
cartoon comic book character write to me and let me know who you think this is going to be so once i have my basic shape i can add to it and then i'll put it back into the oven and while it is still soft i can kind of move it around put these things on here so i'm showing you this here so you can get an idea looks like my character here needs a little bit longer arm and I'm going to see if I can get away with adding more clay to this and not having to have an armature all the way out for his fist here so all right and it's just rough it's kind of like a rough sketch of drawing a cartoon character and i can see that without the armature here it's going to be a little tough to get some strength in his fist and his wrist but his forearm looks good and then I'm just finding some tools. This is a tool that I found, you know, for one of those iPhones. But the best thing that I found was these, uh, oh, let's see, little pencil that I found because it's smooth and I can kind of roll it, use this pencil edge like a rolling pin to kind of smooth things out and move things around but don't be afraid to do a little bit at a time uh, put layer upon layer on it experiment see what works for you i will uh, try to add some detail on this little creature and in my next video i will talk about adding detail to these little sculptures that hopefully you've found some materials that you can uh, used to create these and uh, hopefully my comic book hero will be uh, finished as well so a little bit long video today I appreciate you watching through it but we went through a lot uh, talked about the armature remember the salt dough recipe is one part water one part salt and two parts flour very easy to do. If you need to review my other videos, please do so. Of course, subscribe so you get all the videos in your YouTube feed. Thanks again for watching, and I'll see you again next time. Bye-bye.